What is up everybody? Today I am going to show you a few clips from the recording process of a song I wrote called The Fight. And I will also show you my upstairs studio. So how's it going everybody? This is Jack McLean. Jack McLean guitar. I hope everyone had a sick and safe New Year's. So, as I was saying in this video, I am going to show you a little studio time we had today. Uh, just a couple clips of us doing a song for my band, my personal band, the Jack McLean Band, which basically is just my dad and I, and our Mac laptop. That's how we perform. We uh, go up on stage. It's just him and I and our laptop and uh, we record all of our own stuff, we produce it all uh, and we play against it basically. I record the bass tracks, he sort of samples and comes up with the samples and the beats. We record, uh, we put those down, uh, we go up on stage, turn it on and uh, we play against it and that uh, for now is the, uh, the whole basis of the Jack McLean band. What we were recording today uh, basically is my song called The Fight. I wrote the song when I was 16, I think, and I'm 26 now, so quite a while ago, but it's always been a staple of what we've played. We just threw down some vocal tracks today. I've already recorded the bass, uh, and I've already done the guitar recordings. The song is complete, basically just without the vocals. It's one of three songs that I'm going to be sending away to a Canadian grant company. Basically they offer grants to uh, up and coming musicians who are looking to put together some form of exciting project. And that's exactly what I'm wanting to do basically. So their criteria is get three songs, if you're a songwriter, three of your songs and uh, send them in. And, uh, and I don't know, tough, crazy criteria, but that's what I'm going to do. I'm really excited about this grant, though. It really is a godsend for me if, if, it, if it actually goes through. Basically, over the last few years, I've been lying to myself and trying to put myself into careers that uh, paid a lot and uh, looked good to other people, you know, to my family, to people I was trying to impress for some reason, even though I've always had this amazing, not amazing, but this this talent, this musical talent, and I've always been told that it's always been sort of pushed aside because, you know, oh, you can't, it's never going to pay, or, you know, it's not going to, it's not going to pay in the end, or it's just going to be too stressful, or it's too difficult, or whatever. That's what I've always been hearing. Uh, so I went into truck and coach. I, I just finished being a truck and coach apprentice. I got laid off because honestly I wasn't <laughs> that good at it. I am uh, not very mechanically inclined and never was brought in, into a mechanically inclined family, never grew up around it, but worked my way into apprenticeship in truck and coach and just, you know, a couple months ago actually, it really dawned on me that I couldn't be doing that for the rest of my life and getting laid off basically sort of snapped me into reality that uh, not only is it not the right place for you, but you're not very good at it either, so you gotta really just go with your heart and go for, and go towards, I should say, what you, your, your true passion is and what your, uh, your true goal is. So that's what uh, my whole page really and, and all these little projects are about is just me showing you the real me and just expressing my true passion. I'm so sorry I... Let me just warm up a little bit here. I'm so sorry I... I'm 
so sorry I, I know you're angry now but I'll try to help it'll be okay I didn't